I passed myself. So let me just run you guys through the documents that you need to have with you as you apply for your license if you want to practice in Zambia. Yeah, Moonsha. Handing in without paying. Dodge the exams. Can find yourself in another sub for HPCs. <laughs> tuning in so right now i'm at hpcz hq in olympia and by the grace of god i passed my sub and so i'm applying for my license to practice medicine in the republic of zambia so right now <clears throat> so i wasn't able to vlog properly yesterday but what i was doing yesterday was um just picking up my transcript in school so um basically the process involves clearing with the school like clearing with my um institution and then after that i paid for my transcript and then that was that's what i was doing yesterday i was collecting my transcript from school Dr. Choka. <laughs> and um so today all that's left now so let me just run you guys through the documents that you need to have with you as you apply for your license if you want to practice in Zambia. So firstly, um, you of course need the application form. Um, so the HPCZ application form that you need to fill in and have signed by commission of oaths. So that's what I did yesterday. I was at the police station, central police station. managed to get that signed that was yesterday um i also managed to get my okay so that's the first thing you need a signed copy of the hpcz um application registration form and then next here i have my medical report that's the second document i have all these documents have to be certified on me next document is my transcript seven years no sub honey except at the end <laughs> Okay, so the next document you need um, is your transcript or result from this one's from like 2015 up until the very end so I have that certified next is my grade 12 school certificate I think you could also use like your result slips but as long as they're certified I don't know child but yeah this is the next the third document fourth document I'm mentioning the next document is certified copies of my NRC. There we go. You guys have not seen my NRC picture. Next document. Okay, so these are um, the results. Sorry if there's a lot of background noise here. There's so much happening outside. There's somebody on their phone. Gates are opening. Okay, so next after this is two certified passport size photos. So after exams, I got these done. So i wish this was my nrc picture honey it looks so cute look how cute i looked hmm? imagine me in someone's wallet can we cut all right so these are certified copies of my passport size photos you only need to so i feel like i was mumbling a lot let me just run you guys through one more time so hpcz form uh, signed by the commission of oaths right the application form next is a medical report certified next is um my transcript of results certified next is grade 12 certificate certified next is my nrc copy certified so all these were certified at um the police office i went to central police in town and lastly, but not the least, um, two passport size photos even handing in. So yeah, guys, let's go inside and hand these in. Ciao, before the legs come looking for us. Hey, guys, 
I feel so like I don't know how this process will be different after the licentiate exams come in but um, this is a guide anyway so if you're watching this and you're a graduating medical student you've just finished your um, seven years six years five years of practice congratulations um, this is a huge achievement I hope you're proud of yourself it wasn't easy getting here we all know the struggle of med school so I'm proud of you I hope you are too and yeah so i hope this serves as a guide for those of you who are watching this for a guide um so those are the documents you need make sure they're all certified um make sure your passport size photos that i attached are also th certified and yeah the rest is easy peasy from here i guess oh lastly yeah moonsha handing in without paying <laughs> okay so lastly let me add that you have to pay for your license imagine guys you finish school then they make us pay anyway um so yeah lastly before i forget the last thing you need to do is make sure you have paid for your license um the price right now is roughly about two thousand two and a half thousand somewhere there for our licenses so make sure you also deposit um you'll see deposit details on the request form on the report form the what is it request form i'm thinking of the word um application form yes registration form so oh and other than that you also need to have an hpcz indexing number which we already got like our school already organized that for some of us for the majority of us a long time ago so that's um that's another thing so yeah um anyway i'll have this information listed in the description box below just in case some of you are lost i know i've mumble jumbled haven't really organized my thoughts as i was going to record this but yeah anyway guys so that's that so me here i'm not even going inside i have to go to the bank first first and pay and pay and then come back but you know i'm supposed to do this on monday with my friend but anyway so i'm feeling like maybe i should just come back on monday no procrastination Okay, so what's the time? If the banks aren't closed, no, it's like one thirty in the afternoon. So maybe I could go to the bank and deposit. Yeah. All right, guys. Disorganization. I don't know if I want to wear a mask. So guys, this life of being an independent woman sucks. I miss being a dependent. Anyway, so right now I'm going to stand the bank to deposit and then quickly go back to HBC. The time is like 10 to 2. So they're still open. I think they close at 2 or 2.30. I'm not going to stay but yeah, all right. Hey guys, I am so hungry. It's like, what's the time? The time is 14.30. So I'm going back to HPCZ to pay. I mean, I'm going back to HPCZ to submit my application.
get my code of ethics book my lab coat i hope it fits me well i didn't try it for size i didn't try it on for size so yeah um what else so yeah can you believe that they told me that we could actually do that process online i wish i knew um you can do the process online put in your nrc blah blah, blah. there's like an hbcz portal so i wish i knew that before because that would have meant that i didn't have to rush over physically and whatever and i could pick up the lab coat and book another day anyway um yeah at least that's done guys we've dodged the exams <laughs> Avenge yourself in another sub for HBCs. <laughs> Being very silly. Okay, anyway. Um, so right now I'm so hungry. I ate some chicken duck. But I think I just want some hungry lion in my system right now. So I think that's what I'm going to do. But this is the last clip for today. Thank you so much for coming along with me. If you're watching, please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you enjoy my content. Like the video if you like it. Subscribe if you want to be part of my... Eh, this traffic. Subscribe if you want to be part of my team. A team. Mm, I think I put on my team. Okay, one of my subbies. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share. Reach out to me on Instagram. And yeah, today was a nice day. It was I, I just like how I managed to do so many things in such a short period of time. You know what I mean? But yeah, um I'm glad that piece of work is done. Thank you so much for watching you guys. So I think I'll see you guys tomorrow. We we'll see you tomorrow. I'm supposed to start getting ready for induction and graduation. Like I have to do my nails. I have to check on my outfit. I have to. Hmm, I don't see much I'm wearing at this point. Anyway.